What you doing, beautiful? Wake up in hair. Yeah. Yeah, this may or may not be an epic fail, this hair. <laughs> I'm sure I'll leave it like this for the shoot. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. I think that's a good look on you. What's that little girl's name? Uh, Shirley Temple. Shirley Temple, there you go. Remember, you saw always tell me this hair and my hair is curly. <laughs> so I remember. Yeah, just doing hair and makeup, and then I still have to do my nails. So I'll probably do that in the car on the way there. Oh, I guess that means I'm driving. Duh. <laughs> do you think I was ever driving? Oh, my God. So. so this is part of the process she goes through for photo shoots. I normally do not curl my hair because I don't trust myself. This is actually the second time that I've ever used this in my life. So I'm not sure that was the best idea, but regardless of what happens, I'm going to pretend this is what I meant to do <laughs> because I, there's no turning back. I have to leave in like 30 minutes. So. It's going to come out good. You. We'll probably show you guys some more like behind the scenes stuff as soon as we get to the shoot. So we're outie. Hair and makeup are finally done and we're headed to Malibu for our shoot. Are you excited? Very excited. I am very excited too. So I think we're on time, right? Yeah, we'll be on time, so that's always good. And it's beautiful out today. Let's see if I can show you. I don't know if you can see. So, driving down, are we Malibu Canyon Road? Uh, we are on. I don't even know what road we're on. Is this Canaan? Okay, we're taking Canaan, which is like another canyon road, right? Another canyon, yeah. Canyon road. Um, so, it's really pretty. You can go through like the it's Santa Monica the, Mountains. It's actually the scarier one. Yeah, it is a little frightening at times. I wonder if they can see that. I wonder in a Hummer it is anyway. Well, yeah, because like at any moment, if you mess up, we can definitely tip over. So, yeah, you know, just go down the side of a cliff. End up at least we'll look good going out, right? <laughs> Do you like how we did our little matchy match? He's white and like this, what is it? Pastel green. Pastel green. And this pretty. What color would you call this? Pastel orange. Pastel orange. <laughs> so basically, we look like an Easter egg. But whatever, we look but good. it looks good. It looks good. We look good. Mm. It's okay to say that we look good. We're a cute couple, huh? Mm. I think so. It's our engagement photos, so I'm allowed to be a little mushy on this. Oh. But I would be anyways. <laughs> Cop! Yeah. Oh, please don't turn your lights on. I'm doing 55. That's right. You stay put. Oh my god. <laughs> I would have been speeding you when you stayed put. Nope. Alright, we'll see you guys when we get there. We're so here in Malibu at our shoot. It's gorgeous out today. Perfect weather. And we have a pretty badass setup. We're pretty proud of this. I brought my tanning tent to the beach. So that way when I have to do like a wardrobe change and stuff, I just come in here, change, and it's facing like the rocks. So yeah, I don't know, I just feel pretty genius for that. But we'll um, get some honey seeds footage and let you know how it goes. Out here at Emily's bikini shoot right now. We just finished up our engagement photos. Thought we'd give you guys a little behind the scenes. There's our photographer, killing it, funny guy. She's got a few different looks, probably like four or five other ones that she's going to do. She's looking stunning today.
YouTube. So we just got home from the photo shoot and we both got a lot of sun. You can see Brandon is sunburned back there. I'm like red as a lobster right now. And I actually think that my spray tan saved me from getting super sunburned, but I can still feel it kind of, it's a little uncomfortable being outside. Um, photo shoot was amazing. Uh, we worked with Mai Tai Productions. Is that how you say it, Ben? Mai Tai? Mai Tai, right? So. I think that's how you say it. I'll um, put their little link below. They're the same people who shot for Jade Fitness Wear. Um, so we shot with them again. It's Stefani and David, right? Yep. So, I don't know, sorry, I don't know why I questioned that. Um, and they're absolutely amazing. They're so much fun to work with. They work great together as a couple, and they both have their own little part in it. And it just worked out beautifully for our engagement photos and for my portfolio photos. So I'm um, so happy. I already know we're going to have amazing pictures. Um, I got to see some behind the scenes footage that Brandon was taking while I was um, shooting. And then also we saw some of the couple shots and they all just seemed to be really great. So we are thrilled and cannot wait to see the pictures. So I'm petting Rambler right now. Yeah, he's so happy we're home. But it's so funny if you watch, um, I'm sure you just watched me with my hair all nice and whatever. And now it's like ridiculous looking. I literally was like completely covered in ocean water. I was laying in the water and they were like, now hold that pose and that face while the water hits you. And I like don't know when it's coming. And then all of a sudden it's like, Whoa! and just like totally took me over. And then we decided that it was a little too aggressive, not very sexy. <laughs> but um, we are going to eat a small meal, shower, and then I have lots of client emails to get to. We're gonna get to as many as I can tonight and hit the gym. So thank you guys for watching this far and I hope you've enjoyed the video. Hey everyone, so I finally got all of the sand out from everywhere and I just got to the gym, I'm in the parking lot and I was just thinking about how like tired I am, you know, from the sun and just like the whole day and everything. But with all of that, like just having so much gratitude for like everything and just where I am in life and who I'm with like, I just never in a million years would have imagined that I would be where I am with who I am. Um, I mean, I just took engagement photos, you know? And for me, that's, I don't know, it's like a really big step from where it was quite a few years ago. Um, I know it may not seem like it to a lot of people, but I was 110% convinced that I was a person who was never going to get married. I would never find someone like that that I would be able to fully trust and make that commitment to. Um, I just accepted that and I don't know, I just had like given up on it completely. So the fact that I just like took engagement photos with the most amazing person that I've ever met in my life who is like my absolute best friend and I love him more than anything, like just that alone is crazy to me. So uh, I'm just so happy with everything. Like, I, I just, I'm so thankful for everything that's going on right now. Uh, not to mention like my career and all the stuff happening with that and you know the sponsorships that I've gotten recently. It's just like, I just get, you know when I start thinking about it, I just kind of randomly get a little overwhelmed with just gratitude and thankfulness and I just can't believe it man. So, um, if you guys are struggling with anything, you know, maybe you're the person who thinks that you're never going to find the person that you're supposed to be with, or maybe you're struggling financially. I'm not saying I have my shit together, because trust me, there's a lot that's not together. Um, I'm just saying I'm a lot further than where I was a few years ago, and I'm very grateful for where I'm at right now. Still pushing really hard, still, I mean, I have a an insane amount of areas to improve on and trust me financial status could be a lot better a much 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 better um so please don't take this the wrong way i'm just saying i'm very thankful for where i'm at right now you know we're able to buy our groceries we're able to pay rent um 
life is good, man. Life is really, really good. And if today was my last day on earth, it was amazing. All right, thanks for the little heart to heart. I'm gonna go in there. Uh, my goal for this workout is to have a really high intense workout. So I'm gonna be doing uh, supersets and tri-sets with, instead of doing a break, I'm gonna have cardio in between those sets. So, you know, any kind of cardio movement. Um, my ankle is still kind of iffy, but I feel like it's recovering, so I'm not going to do any side-to-side -side jumping or anything, but I know I can do like jump rope or step-ups or, um, you know, lunges or anything that'll get my heart rate going. So really high intense workout, some hit cardio after, and then I'm going to be done for the night. So thank you guys for listening to me. I hope you don't think I'm a huge baby for kind of getting emotional sometimes. Um, but like I said, I'm passionate about what I care about most and what I care about most is Brandon, this lifestyle, my family, you know, my friends, my clients. So all this stuff just like it hits home, <laughs> really hits home with me. So um, I hope you guys have an amazing day and I will see you. I'll see you later. Last night of cardio. Just finished my cardio session and now it's time to head home. I did a hit training today and then I did a quick hit cardio session today. So that's gonna be all my training for the day. Super sweaty. Um, I was like literally dying at the end. I'm still dripping right now. If you say that you did hit, you better be dripping because if you're not dripping, then I'm sorry, but reality check, you did not do hit. So I'm gonna drink some of this ice cold water. And turn that home, John.